What up everybody? My name is Impractical and welcome back to Sonic Speed Team. And today we're going to be going over every single Halloween skin that we have so far. That's right. Every skin that I have in my collection so far, Star 6 of course, we're going to be doing a whole display of every skin and showing off their stats. That's right. I took a saw some of you guys in the comments for my every six star skin video asking that I should display stats next time. So I'm going to be doing it in this video. And we're also going to be talking about the possible Halloween skins that may come out this Saturday with the release of Pumpkin Hill. So without further ado, let's just get into it. As you can see, every Halloween skin is here and we're going to be showing off all their stats, of course. But let's just get into this. Let's look at these skins and see what we have so far. We have a total of 10 Halloween skins and Sonic. Well, Sonic is the lucky one who has two. So uh, I kind of have my own ideas of what possible skins they may be coming out with for this year. I know leaks aren't dropping anymore like they used to, but that doesn't stop us from coming up with our own predictions or the most likely can steel pick for this event now these skins of course you will be able to get them again in this month of october either through a re-release or some type of event or in the premium shop to purchase with robux now i will say though some of these skins will be valued more than others like last year everyone was going crazy for werehog i'm pretty sure a lot of folks remember the the crazy trade chats about hey how much werehog cost for this and that once trade was released now that we're actually going through our first year of a halloween event with trade available the question comes will we be able to stack up on dupes and uh how will the market react to, to a mass amount dump of a uh, of all these Halloween skins. But that's not a bad thing. Because of trade, more players will have access to these Halloween skins if they're unable to clear an event. So again, this is looking like a very promising Halloween event year. Other than that, the other stuff that I'm more interested in is a lot of the mounts and stuff that I missed last year, so I can't wait to pick those up. But skins are always the big highlight and topic of discussion when it comes to these huge seasonal events events and honestly i can't wait for them to unveil what new skins we're going to be getting for this year now if you're looking for my opinion on what's the best skin that we have so far already it's got to be gothic amy for that heavy focus on xp and magnet of course i know i know it's a hot take but again i'm looking at it stat wise if it comes to a personal favorite it's going to be either werehog or pumpkin omega for me which again i'm a huge fan of pumpkin omega i just love the look now let's get into our prediction section of the video this is what we're going to be discussing about what's the possible halloween skins that we'll get in sonic speed simulator now i'm going to be honest with all of you there is an obvious answer to this and it will make a lot of sense for them to drop this skin with the release of pumpkin hill and that's got to be the pumpkin sonic skin from sonic adventure battle 2. On screen, you're gonna be seeing this skin and uh, it's it's an obvious choice. It's an easy choice. We already have City Escape. We already have uh, Space Colony Arc. So of course it will be an easy skin to make for them and you know, throw in the game. Another character besides Sonic I can see getting an additional skin will have to be Amy. In Sonic Forces Speed Battle, she does have a fortune teller costume, which will fit perfect with the Halloween theme, and it could be her costume of choice. Of course, we do have a costume outfit for her, but that's more of a gothic Lolita and not an actual Halloween costume, where the fortune teller would just be right on the nose for Amy. Another easy dupe will be for Knuckles. He does have a Mummy Knuckles variation that you can find in Sonic Runners that will fit perfectly with the Halloween theme. And I know I'm speaking out about a lot of dupes, but these are easy ones and that have designs that are already out there that they could just create off of. Now let's talk about characters that are already in the game that could use additional skins and most likely will receive a Halloween skin. Those are going to be very obvious to say, but Blaze and Silver are right there at the top. They have been getting uh, some additional skins as of late and just to see them getting more skins, especially through this Halloween event, will be kind of an easy prediction or an expectation, especially when we all know someone on the team is a big fan of Silver. So 
you can't miss an opportunity to give him a good Halloween skin. Now, what that skin would be, I'm not too sure on. He has a lot of designs in other Sonic games that we could pull from, and there are other artworks of him as well. So it's kind of like tricky to figure out what would be a good costume for him. I keep bouncing back between some official artwork designs and then what I see in Sonic Forces Speed Battle, but he does have a lot of different variations where they can either be inspired from or just directly rip off and put in the game. Now that I think about it, a lot of the Sonic Channel artwork was previously in the past used for inspiring a lot of the skins we see out now in Sonic Speed Simulator and in other Sonic mobile games as well for their alternate costumes. And so if I just show all these channel artworks on the screen, we will possibly get something that's inspired from this, especially if you look at all the October ones. Now, what are we gonna get? Not, again, not too sure. This part of the video is mostly on uh, speculation and just predicting of what we might get in the future. But again, anything is possible. With that being said, a big skin with him in a froggy suit will be amazing. And I would definitely love to get that. I, I would even pay Robux for that skin. Crazy ideas aside, let's take this into the comment section. That's right, comment down below your thoughts on which characters are gonna be getting Halloween skins this year. And also let me know what skins you wanna see in the game as well. I will be down there chatting with all of you. Don't forget to hit that like button. And if this is your first time watching one of my videos, don't forget to subscribe. I got plenty more content coming out for the rest of the week and also this month as well for all of you to enjoy. As always, I'll see all of you in the next video. Bye-bye.